What's going on guys? Welcome back to the Vault Pro Scooters. Today we're here for another custom build. And this one's special. We just got in the new Aztec 2020 line of parts and in that line, there is a ton of super light product. So we thought it was only right to do an updated version of the lightest custom build possible. So we're gonna head to the warehouse, pick out some parts, weigh them and see if we can make the lightest custom possible. So. Let's get to it. We made it to the warehouse. We're gonna go ahead and start off with the deck. It's not gonna be a surprise uh, what deck I'm going with. The Aztec Hydro deck is now the lightest deck on the market. Previously, it was the Pandemonium. I'm gonna go ahead and grab a Pandemonium deck along with the Hydro deck, just so you guys can see the weight difference. Pandemoniums are there. Grab that in just a sec. I'm gonna be grabbing the 19.5 inch black Hydro deck. Obviously, the shorter length is gonna make it lighter. That's the goal of today's video. And also, I'm not gonna be taking like any huge shortcuts to make this thing as light as possible. I'm still gonna be using everything, but it's just gonna be light. It's not safe to not ride bar ends. Not riding a dust cover is stupid, because then you're gonna get dirt in your headset. There are some things that I'm gonna be doing to really make it light, but they're not shortcuts. Also, what's new in scootering went live a few days ago. I went over the whole Aztec 2020 line of parts, so if you guys wanna know more about not only the Hydra deck, but the bars and wheels and forks and everything, click the link up there. Go check that out. The Pandemonium deck is a bit shorter. This is 19.3 and the Hydro deck is 19.5. So take that into account. I don't think it's gonna make a huge difference. Pandemonium, 19.3, two pounds, 7.9 ounces. Incredibly light. Two pounds, 6.1 ounces. A little bit of a weight difference in that. It, it feels like a lot. Like I can tell you right now, holding these in my hand, this thing, is, this thing is light. I'll grab a headset while I'm here. There was only one headset that really made sense to use and it is the Ethic silicone headset. So it does have this rubber dust cover instead of the traditional aluminum one. And it does make a weight difference. It's not a lot at all. It's barely a weight difference, but it's something. So we're gonna go ahead and use this. Two ounces. That's it, two ounces. 2.3, it's lighter, I told you. Not a lot, but it's something. Let's grab a fork. Fork of choice isn't gonna be a surprise. Aztec Circa V2. This was also released in the new line. It's the exact same fork as the V1. It's got a new updated look, looks great. And it's light, let's go weigh it. I'm gonna weigh it with hardware and everything because it's gonna have hardware on the scooter. 7.9 ounces. Let's go ahead and grab a clamp. I feel like I'm gonna keep repeating myself. You're probably not gonna be surprised on what clamp I'm using. I think basic aluminum clamp here. This is the clamp that Walter used on his Off-White Custom. That clamp comes in a little heavier, just a little bit. Self clamp is still lightest clamp and Gotta, gotta use it, that's the way we're doing it. Damn, Matisse. Oh! Let's grab bars. I actually have a pair of TV Titanium T-Bars. I was gonna use them, that was the plan. Little did I know, the Envy Union tie bars Way less, so I have to use them. Raymond Warner, this is for you. One pound, 10.6 ounces. The TV Titanium bars weighed one pound, 11 ounces. <laughs> so, just a little bit, it's just a little bit, but that little bit, all added up makes a big difference. Wheels, we gotta grab wheels. Listen, I'm gonna be real with you. I really wanted to use these. These are the turbine wheels. I really wanted to use them because they look cool to me. They would have matched my color scheme perfectly. But they weigh like, a, like an ounce more than Honeycores. And James here behind the camera bullied me and said I can't use them and he's in charge. So I gotta use Honeycores. Yeah, it was 0.4 ounces heavier. It, it was like 0.4 ounces, yeah. So. I'm gonna go ahead and use white on black root Honeycore wheels. One wheel, 7.1 ounces. This whole fork weighs as much as this one Honeycore. What? We'll go ahead and grab grips. You guys probably think I'm gonna use like ODIs or something because they're short, but no. Ethic foam grips, baby. And since the foam grips don't actually come with bar ends, I'm gonna grab a pair of these ODI ones in white. I'm not gonna take any shortcuts. Like I said, I want there to be bar ends on the scooter. So whoever picks this up and buys it, they're not gonna impale themselves with the end of a titanium bar. And these don't weigh really anything. And since they're white, they're gonna match the wheels. The bar ends weigh six ounces. No, no, <laughs> that's- Oh, I'm sorry. They weigh 0.6 ounces and the grips, 1.1 ounce. Remember, we're not talking pounds, boys and girls. Ounces, we are talking ounces. Oh, I need an HIC kit. Um, that's like boring stuff. Let's just go grab it. I need the shortest HIC kit possible, so I think the root is gonna be the best option. And let's go grab grip tape. This is where the surprise comes in. Dude, we're getting our exercise today. We're just going back and forth to the end of the warehouse. Believe it or not, guys, Avid deck pins, way less than a sheet of grip tape. A lot less. A lot less. This is a sheet of Sandesi grip tape, 
1.6. So the whole set of deck pins weighs 0.5 ounces. I'm not using the whole set. It's light. It's less than a sheet of grip tape, like I said. So it's, we gotta use it. I'm gonna go have my manager Ephraim install these. I'll be back in just a sec. Cool, deck pins are installed. Thank you, Ephraim. Let's gather the rest of the parts and head to the studio and start building it. Okay, you guys, we're back in the studio. I got my deck pins installed. They look great. I already did weigh everything, but I will go through the parts one last time for you just so you know exactly what I'm using. So, starting out with the deck, Aztec Hydro Deck, lightest deck on the market right now. Root Industry Honey Cores, no surprise there. The Aztec Circo Fork at the self clamp in the oversized version to go on these Envy Union Titanium Bars. I'm using the Ethic Foam Grips. I went with the Ethic Silicone Headset. And last but not least, some basic white ODI bar ends that are gonna match the urethane on the wheels perfectly and prevent anybody from being impaled. Let's move everything out and go ahead and start building it. So, I don't have to grip a deck, that's nice. We'll start with putting on the fork. A long bolt here. Went ahead, put some grease on the headset. Uh, it doesn't do too much. It's pretty much just gonna prevent the um, bearing from seizing in the cup of the deck. So I'm gonna do the same for the top bearing. And we do sell lithium grease on our website just in case you guys wanna buy a little tube for yourself. Normally you do have a compression ring um, that's separate, but it's cool the silicone headset has the compression ring installed. So I just slide it down like that. It's already good to go. Got my Root Industries HIC kit. I'm gonna slide that on. Here is my M8 bolt and washer. I'm gonna throw just a little bit of grease on that too, just to help those threads. It looks great. I love the circle fork with the Hydro Deck. They're kind of made for each other, so. Let's go ahead and install the back wheel. Let these go in. Like that. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait. Like that? Yeah, like that. I figured it out. Cool. I'm hungry. Leave me alone. I was just clowning Ephraim for not being able to put this axle through. <laughs> Almost got it. <laughs> I believe in you. No, you don't. Don't even try to lie to the camera. Yeah. I got it. Oh, there it is. Bam. Back wheel is installed. So we'll go ahead and install the front wheel as well. Front wheel should be a little bit easier than the back wheel. Cool, front wheel is installed. That's what we're looking like so far. This weighs nothing. Like I'm telling you, this is light. Let's go ahead and throw our grips on. Bam, grips are installed. A good thing to note is the NV Union Titanium Bars do already come with the slit installed. So, saves us some time and trouble. All I have to do is throw these bar ends in. Throw the bars on, tighten it up, and we are good to go. Just like that. It's a little bit of tough love, not too much. And there we go. The bar ends are a nice little touch, just to match the urethane. Drum roll, please, guys. You better be drumming, like on your desk or something. I don't know. All right, moment of truth, guys. I have not picked it up yet, so I don't know how heavy it is. I'm super excited. I have my scale here. We're gonna we're gonna weigh it, of course. A majority of scooters weigh anywhere between nine and like 11 pounds, like an out of the box scooter. What do you think this thing is gonna weigh? I'm curious, drop a comment. Yo, this thing is so light. Oh my gosh. This is like nothing. As you can see, I do have to put this clear box on here so I can actually weigh the scooter and it doesn't touch the table. But as you can see, this weighs nothing. The scale is still reading zero, zero, so it'll still be accurate. But let's set it on there. Five pounds, 11.9 ounces. Five pounds, 11.9 ounces. 10 pounds, 11.8. It's literally five pounds less, right? On the dot, five pounds. This, this, okay, this weighs 10 pounds, 11.8 ounces. This weighs five pounds. 11 point ounces. It's like half the weight. It's half the weight. <laughs> I mean, yeah, apples and oranges, but still. Uh, yeah, exactly. Dude, James, feel this. You need to feel this. Jesus Christ. <laughs> like. Nothing. It. It's nothing. It turned out great. I could not be happier. Aztec killed it with all these new products. Envy Union tie bars look great. And the honey cores, of course, do their job perfectly. This is the lightest scooter out there. Chop the deck, chop the bar, 
Don't ride a dust cover, no bar ends, no grips, nothing, take off the brake. Of course it's gonna be lighter, but this is a complete scooter. It's got a brake, bar ends, dust cover, and deck pins, and it is still five pounds. Ephraim, perfect, the perfect candidate to see how much this thing weighs. We wanna get your reaction. Jesus <laughs> Christ. Five pounds, 11.8 ounces. That's ridiculous, and it's all dialed in. Mm -hmm. Dude, that came out sick. The pins were a good way to go. The pins were the move, for sure. Let's head into the warehouse, and then we'll head upstairs too. I think Sean's here. I wanna hear what Sean has to say. Matisse. Hey. Matisse, we want your reaction on the weight of this bad boy. Oh, yeah, this is actually really light. Like, honestly, like, honestly speaking, they're like a quad kick was flat on this. How much do you think it weighs? I don't know. Uh, probably like six pounds. Five pounds, 11.8 ounces. Five pounds. Sheesh. Jesus, it's heavy. <laughs> no, this thing is really light, Jesus. How much do you think it weighs? Six pounds, 34 ounces. Five pounds, 11.8 ounces. Damn. Also, 34 ounces is like two pounds. You know what? I was just trying to sound <laughs> smart. And... 34 ounces. <laughs> We're gonna head up front. Um, there's some kids up here. We're just gonna go see what they think. Well, that's light. So now feel that, right? Now feel that. It's, 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 big it's a big difference, right? Damn. <laughs> <laughs> that's insane. Is it really like that light? Oh man, I'm worried. What? This, is a, this doesn't make any sense. We're gonna go out on a limb and say five pounds. Five pounds, 11.8 ounces. Wow. That's a chromoly bar, right? This is like just a bar, like, <laughs> <laughs> just grab a bar and it's the same. Hey, Sean Cardwell. Come here. Hey, Austin Spencer. <laughs> Walt, Walt already did that. <laughs> yeah, well, I did it too. <laughs> that, is, that is pretty light though. Okay, what do you think it weighs? Someone already told me. Oh, Ephraim told you, yeah. yeah. Way to ruin the weight for Sean. <laughs> What's the current lightest custom built? Do we know? The one that I did with the pandemonium. I don't remember exactly what the weight is. Let's it, just go to YouTube. What's that? Great slushies dropped a new YouTube video? What? First Feed. one in over a year? What? Why are there deck pins on it? Deck pins are lighter than grip tape. What? Five pounds. Is it less? There's no way. I think the scale wasn't reading it right. James is shook. Uh, I don't think. Yeah, really we'll just unpublish this video, dude, and like no one will ever know. Um, it only did 105,000. Nobody will ever know. Did you weigh it wrong last time? I think I weigh I had to have weighed it wrong. Look at where his back wheel is. Oh my god. On the god. table. I mean, you can't see that it is actually okay, sitting on the table. I mean, it's, I know how weight yeah, works. Really so you got to redact the old weight on that one. <laughs> yes. We're gonna say it weighs. Ultimate six park pounds. build? Question mark. Answer is no. This is stupid. Holy moly. So before I get out of here, let's go see if it's dialed. And of course it's dialed. I didn't think anything less and it sounds great. It looks great. It weighs absolutely nothing. What more do you need? All right, you guys, so that is it for today. Make sure you do smash the like button if you enjoyed. Subscribe for more videos. Drop a comment down below suggesting more videos and make sure you guys tune in next Friday for another custom build. My name is Austin. I'll see you guys in another video.